Well, they did just all take fire to the face, so they're going to be aiming for you, Mega. Yep, I figured. <laughs> yeah, well, at least we get to that leather. Miss. Does 15 hit you? Uh, with the leather, it says 17 is the AC. Really? You sure about that? What's the AC bonus is five, right? The uh, max for the dexterity mod is going to be two. So yeah. Make sure that's not set too high. Yeah, two from that, five from the AC, and it's armor class is plus ten by default, right? You only get uh, twelve, or just the uh, base is, two. You get the two from is, the armor, I believe. Yeah, cause... the base is ten. He, Sindo said the armor gives you three, so that will be thirteen, and then... Two for Whatever your deck two, is. two, okay, fifteen. Oh okay. yeah, the two yeah, goes next to two. So yeah, so fifteen. <laughs> Ty goes to defender. So Ty goes to defender. Basically, that is a good thing we got you that armor, man. I already <laughs> saved you. <laughs> that arrow comes and gets deflected off the teeth of one of your shoulder pads. Ouch! I'll switch that. That way, it shows up right on the yeah. macro. Sorry about that. And another defender. Same thing. Okay. Damn right. That armor was the best thing that ever happened to you. Yeah, I've got to change his <laughs> Damn straight. Armor has its own AC. This guy is still pointing his sword at you and yelling at his men. He seems more like the uh, commander of this group than uh, just a bodyguard. <laughs> Mega. Okay, I am going to cast another Scorching Ray at the same three individuals. So, it should work now. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, first guy. Yeah, there we go. Second nice guy. And then wow. third guy. Your rolls, man. Are you a mentor? Yeah, man. Nice. He is a mentor, actually. <laughs> well, that makes sense. <laughs> 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 it's one of the running jokes here. Because yeah. I'm a mentor, I always get crits. Yeah. Oh man, these guys are not looking good. So, yeah. But they're still standing. Wow. Crunk. All right. I move uh, to right here, and I cast uh, Thunder Wave at level one. So all right, those as you move there. They're going to use their ready to action to attack you. No. Okay. You did walk into the spear wall. <laughs> Miss. Miss. Do you need to? Macy. Do you God need to renew you. your AC mentor? <laughs> <laughs> They'll come. Just not with the weak guys. Okay, you're there. I'll laugh at him and then like just fucking reach my hand out with my uh, battle hammer in it and just cast Thunder Wave at him. So all those guys have to make uh, constitution saving throws. Alright, first guy. 16, 12, and 5. I'm pretty sure the third one failed. So uh, they take that damage or if if they fail the saving throw it's uh they take the full damage and are pushed 10 feet away and on a uh, successful save they take half damage and are not pushed away what's the save and it's an area effect 15 foot cube emanating from me so just these three spear guys so here and what's the AC for the... Oh, my spell DC? save DC is... Uh, for the save, sorry, it is... Um, 12, actually. So two save, one fails miserably and gets pushed back 30 feet? 10 feet. Okay. And, and the others take half? Yeah, just half and are not pushed. Okay. They're a bit. In the uh, 
move as a bonus action, I can move my hammer and make an attack with it. Okay. So I am moving him to there. So I add four to that uh, melee spell attack because I'm blessed. No, you have to roll one d4. Oh, roll. Okay. Yeah. So they're saying that leather is normally just one, one AC. Yeah, isn't it hide plus one so, though? So, or not leather? So it'd be two. Well, yeah, it would be two. Okay, so it'd be fourteen total. I thought they you were, said it was hide. Well done. That's why enough for uh, plus one. It's essentially adding hide to the leather. AC. Oh, okay. So what's the total AC for it? Twelve, or two. Sorry. Two. Wow. <laughs> Twelve would be insane. Well, it's it's like oh, your base is ten, uh, base with armor is, yeah, it's it's weird. <laughs> yeah, and you guys need to remember to uh, add the D four. Uh, Thirteen ties defender, so he just deflects it with his bow somehow. <laughs> Crunk. All right. Or right, well, that's it for me. All right, these guys are going to try to attack you again. It's a hit. Oh, God. And I lost the description. Long Spear is a D8, right? Um, I have no idea. I haven't looked at my books and stuff in so long. I know, it's been so long. Uh, long sphere. Two handed weapon, so it's. Yeah, medium is D8. Times and a half. Strength. Oh, you only take four. Okay. Is it strength and a half? I didn't think it was strength and a half for two handed. It's two handed. Only four from that one. I didn't think it was. It's a. Uh, yeah. I don't have. Because it's being wielded with two hands, it's strength and a half for the damage bonus. I don't have an option to make mine two handed. Strength and a half? What? Well, you know how if you have plus one strength modifier. Yeah, no, I, I know what you mean, but it, there's no yeah. option on my character sheet, because I, I have two-handed, and there's no option I to make it. I didn't see anything with that. There's just... Yeah. It's a different damage dice when you wield it two-hand. That's yeah. the only difference. Is it? Yep. It's just yeah, a different because, damage like, dice. Well, if it's versatile, oh. there's a different damage. Like, my Warhammer is a just 1d12 take, if I here, two-handed, take, take and the a four 1d8 damage. with one hand. Take the four damage, and we'll figure it out later. <laughs> Oh, you did it. Yeah, we're fine. Yeah, just take the four and we'll we'll change it up later. Because <laughs> you know we're going to argue it and then he's going to roll up max damage, so. Alright. <laughs> Weapons. Well, I mean, that wouldn't affect his roll. I don't know why you would re-roll it. Yeah. <clears throat> well, unless it was different damage, that than the 1d8. What's he using? Anyways, a long I spear? I'll be getting hit some more. Uh, yeah. I don't even see that in the weapon list. Neither. Huh. Yeah, well, let's just play. We'll figure it out next time. Weapon list actually is grossly under. Yeah, I operate. agree. <laughs> The second edition weapon list was two pages long, man. Well, if if you want it, if you want to use one that's in well relation, is a uh, trident, one d six piercing and one d eight two handed, and can it's more be like thrown. A pike. Where's pike in here? That sounds about right. One d eight two handed thing. I don't know. Uh, it's a d ten. Oh, pike is pike is two handed. Heavy. Cannot be wielded one handed. Okay. And D10. Yeah. Heavy small creatures have disadvantage against uh, t on attack rolls with heavy 
these aren't small creatures, so that doesn't matter. It also has reach, which is. And what race are they? They're just human guys. You have to be really small to be small. Yeah. They changed the scale. <laughs> it used to be different, yeah. but now it's completely. Same with large. You have to be, I think, over ten feet now to be a large, where it used to be seven feet. Yeah, they can basically hit you when you're five feet further away. So yeah. Yeah. And it's D10, not D8. Yeah. Actually, would one second here. I'm looking up range here quickly. And I'm looking at the wrong thing. So we'll just let that go for now. Yeah. Next one. Ooh, that one hits. Okay. So you take another five. He continues to tell his men, stand fast and show. Who's he? Um, I'm going to move up with here and swing. You're lucky they only get tax of ops if you leave their range. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Does that hit? Uh, No. Okay. All right, uh, Varric. Crunk's taking some pretty nasty spear wounds. Uh, I think you're muted. <laughs> Zach? Sorry. <laughs> yeah, there you go. I muted it. Whenever the chain comes by, I try to mute it, and I forgot to unmute it. <laughs> yeah. Do you okay, so live I'm... at a train station? Because normally, like... at least here, there's a train that comes by once every eight hours. <laughs> uh, here, it's where I am. It's like once every five to 20 minutes, actually. If I lived closer wow. yeah, to it. I'm quite frequent. Yeah. But I'm literally like half a block away, so whatever noise they make, you can basically hear it. Yeah. Well, I am in Alaska. We only have one <laughs> line of trains. <laughs> I'm in Canada. We only got one too, and it's in a stupid route. So, <laughs> but it goes by my. It goes through my town. So, <laughs> all right. All right. So, what are you doing? Oh, sorry. Uh, I'm gonna move up and cast Sacred Flame. Just because I can't quite reach you, Crunk. On, uh, we'll say the middle one. Okay. All right. Unfortunately, that does not hit. We're not uh, rolling our hits very well. No. Does 12 hit? Oh, oh. yeah. Fuck, I oh. forgot. Uzi didn't add his. No, before. I didn't. <laughs> yeah. God damn it. Freaking Uzi. I don't know how you got those 80 wins. Not yeah, it's another thing. If you get bonuses, like, you have to remember it. it yourself because I won't remind you. Yeah, I'm not used I to backup. I wrote it down. All right, so archers. Are they at disadvantage because of the spiritual hammer? Uh, the spiritual hammer is incorporeal, I believe. Okay. They can't attack it. It attacks only on uh, Krunk's turn. I just didn't know if it was considered to be a melee with them or not. It technically is. But it's weird. Okay. Cool. That's a miss. Or is it a hit? 14. Uh, yeah, it should be four. Well, hide armor is two yeah, it's, plus one, or is it? Is it hide armor is actually two, and then it's a plus one. It's is it leather two? with crappily uh, harvested hide. Yeah. Put essentially, on top of it, so it's, yeah, essentially it's leather plus one, not hide plus, plus one. That was my bad. Okay, so so then it's a twelve plus decks. Twelve plus so 14, you're at fourteen. So yeah. 
Yeah. Again, the <laughs> wolf's teeth. Whatever. Just blocking arrows left and right. <laughs> That's a hit, though. Yeah. Since I have this up. Short bow. D6. Okay. <sighs> Ouch. Ooh. Yeah. And the last guy. Misses. All right. It's my... There we go. For some reason, it doesn't always do that. So. How much damage was five. it? Negative five. Five. Twelve. Let me switch. Hey, at least you're not a level three rogue with eight HP. <laughs> oh, I know. <laughs> It's your turn now, Mega. Um, let's see. They're 110 feet away. Uh, and they're all extremely burnt and uh, bloody, if you will. Yeah. Unfortunately, I don't think I have anything AOE left. Okay. Um... Let's see, that's you could, oh, that'll uh, work. Yeah, I can move and still I can move and still cast a uh, spell, correct? You can move up to thirty feet and then cast. Okay. Well, let's see. Oh, I'm s I did not <laughs> mean to <laughs> At least it's not penis. I'm happy. Okay. We went through this Bert yeah. back in the beginning. Yeah. There you go. Uh there and I'm gonna target him. I'm okay. gonna go ahead and fire a firebolt at him. Uh, there we go. Attack. You'll probably have to click the check marks. Yeah, it's attack roll, correct? For the... Attack roll and damage. Yeah. Damage. The mm -hmm. sixteen hit, or do I need to roll my d4? No, that that hit. Okay. And you actually drop him. Okay. More fire. <laughs> he hits the ground. See, I'm just lighting things on fire. I'm not exploding them yet. <laughs> All right. Crunk. I am going to um, do... Uh, oh, wait. Let me go back in the bubble. I'm going to cast Thunder Wave again as the, um, at level 1. Still hit some so, all. Uh, I think it includes the square that he's in. Huh? Or does it? Even if it does, hey, it is a cube me, in front so... of you. Huh? Is it in a cube in front right? of you? Or? Yeah, so it would start like at this line right in front of me okay. and Uzi. And go 15 right. feet back, and so 15 foot cube there. Yeah, whatever. So we hit all three of those guys. Do you roll? All right. And there's con save. What was the save DC again? 12. All right, the so third. Guy who saved last time. I mean, who failed last time? Saved this time. <laughs> yeah. That's nine, and then half for the one. All right. This guy is going to move forward. They're all kind of moving together. Trunk. Miss. Miss. Hit. Alright, I want to uh, use my thunderous rebuke on him. When he hits me, I can uh, well, let me look exactly in my 
thing. Yay for reaction. <laughs> it's a reaction, right? Yeah. Take he four. takes 2AD lightning damage. Um, so he has to make a saving throw. Constitution? I assume so. Initially, rebuke an attacker. Dexterity saving throw. It's the exact same. Damn. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Didn't matter. Ouch. <laughs> How much down. did I take? Uh, you took four. You know, these are some really heavy weapons. Normally they hit people harder, but it hasn't really hit you that hard. Yeah, I'm lucky. I could be dead already. I, I, I like, you know, like, oh, buddies. <laughs> I'm, I'm injured. I guess I could have healed myself, but I decided to try to kill people. <laughs> this guy is starting <laughs> to get angry and uh, yelling at his compatriots. Uh, you forgot about your... Well, I thought I needed... The reaction takes my bonus action, right? Or can I do a bonus action and a reaction? Well, the reaction is on your turn. Yeah. It's on their turn while they're attacking you. Yeah, I think Yeah, it's... but it's still this round. I only get one bonus action for the round, right? Uh, okay. Yeah, you're right. So you um, just didn't attack with it. Yeah. Man, I just have to skip it that time. I, I needed to rebuke somebody. Yeah, and it's a good thing you did. You dropped him. Uzi. All right, I'm going to take a step up to here while pulling out my uh, my second sword, which changes that number. And mm. <laughs> and I'm going to attack the uh, middle guy first. Does that hit? Uh, Sixteen's a hit, yeah. All right, for ten damage. Yeah, he drops. And the guy to my left. 15, does that hit? Yes. For 8. He also drops. <laughs> it's not like an overkill blow like yeah. <laughs> before, but... But yeah. Just a 1-2 sure. combo. Uzi just walked up and dropped two of them. <laughs> <laughs> One of them dropped after stabbing Krunk. Yeah. I move up a bit and I'll um, touch Krunk on the shoulder and cast Cure Wounds on him. Wow. Krunk seven. I say thank you, brother, and uh, we're in. I thought I feel much better. Minimum damage or heal. Yeah, plus six. From what I see, it should only be four. D8 oh. plus two plus one. Ow! Hey! Plus level, I think. Or plus two plus one plus. Uh... The plus twos for being life, and then the plus ones, I think, the level of the spell. Oh, you get a bonus for your worries. domain? And then the others. Yeah. From... Level it's a proficiency. Spell. Yeah, you're in the healing domain, so you have the stronger healing stuff. And then proficiency on top of that. That's why. Okay. Proficiency. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Uh, the archers. Uh, the ones that are still standing <laughs> are attacking the wizard still. Oh, one hit. For two damage. <laughs> Not bad. That could be Nothing a lot worse. <laughs> yeah. Okay. yeah, man. There's nothing yeah. like these spear guys' weapons. Yeah. 
kind of worried about these other guys' weapons over here. Mega. My turn, eh? I'm going to go ahead and uh, the next archer down him. I'm going to go ahead and fire a firebolt at him. Oh, okay. wait a minute. You said move, I can move 30 first, right? Yep. Right. You do it first or after. Okay, well, I'll fire my spell. But I'm going to be moving as well, so. Uh, cast spell. <laughs> One. <laughs> uh, it hit. The guy in the middle? Yeah. Wow, that was actually enough to drop. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. Yeah. He hits the ground unconscious. Wait, that's a D10, and you've rolled a two and a one. Yeah, I know. Wow. I, mm. Did I freaking? <laughs> Man, the... I wish you could turn off the ability to do that because I, I'm just stop hitting the right button. I, well, I keep clicking on the line instead of my ruler. Is the problem? Yeah. And I'm gonna move up so I can uh, use. If you select your token and use your arrow keys. It'll move you in five foot increments. Wow. <laughs> wow. Well, yeah, look at that. Yay. I didn't know that. Thank you. <laughs> right. That makes it so much easier. <laughs> I never knew that. Uh, Crunk. The guy in heavy armor is heading towards you. I'm going to take. Holding his uh, katana. I'm going to take my bonus action and tell, uh, or my reaction or. Whatever I'm gonna, I'm just gonna say, hey, Crunk, uh, hold up, wait for me. Hey, so I um, hold on, let me measure here real fast. All right, so I'm gonna step to here. And then I'm going to cast a. Uh, let me look one second. I don't remember. Also, it's been so long. We're actually going overtime. Yeah, <laughs> that's fine. This shouldn't take. We started much later. Yeah, we did. And well, nobody's here. That has to be gone at a certain time, right? Like, obviously, oh, nothing too not ridiculous, but... Because i got to be up at 8 in the morning. <laughs> Some of these I don't... Well, I don't know my daggone range on this thing. Like, inflict... Oh, that's touch. Never mind. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you I can't really love... touch him from here. <laughs> you could touch Uzi if you want. <laughs> yeah. Heyo. <laughs> Yeah, sorry. All right, I'm going to uh, do the uh... all right, sacred flame. Yeah. Yeah, you missed. It. <laughs> you fire off a flame, and it just kind of like dissipates before it reaches the guy. <laughs> so in the, my bonus action, my bonus action, I'm going to uh, attack with my hammer. All right, who are you attacking? The archer, the the archer right in front of it. I'm gonna go ahead and try to finish him off. Let's see. Uh, oh, you actually hit. He's still standing, though. Hmm. All right, yeah, that's it for me. This guy walks up here, cursing and show. Who's he? Hmm. Okay. I walk up. These guys are obviously a lot more uh, experienced than the other guys. Oh, yeah. Like, they have a completely different demeanor. I I walk up with just as just as equal of a demeanor. Okay. And uh, start swinging at this guy, the bodyguard. 